Welcome to our lecture online. So in the previous video when we looked at the van der Waals equation we used the units that are typically used in chemistry and when you look things up on the internet you most often find those units. But in physics we use MKS units. I wanted to show you one more example where we actually use MKS units rather than the units we use in chemistry which is liters and atmospheres instead of cubic meters uh, and, uh, and uh, pascals instead of atmospheres. So again, uh, let's say we have a gas, uh, we have carbon dioxide at zero degrees Celsius with a volume of 22.4 liters, which is 0.0224 cubic meters, one mole. Here's our gas constant, and of course here we have A and B again, the two constants necessary to adjust for the electrical forces and to adjust for the fact that they take up space. But in the case where the molecules are far apart, the electrical forces are going to be very minimal. And yes, there is going to be some effect of the molecules taking up space. So what is going to be the true pressure based upon the van der Waals equation instead of the pressure based upon the ideal gas equation? Using the ideal gas equation, plugging the numbers, we get 101,326 pascals, which is exactly one atmosphere. So now let's plug all the numbers into the equation again. But now instead of using liters and atmospheres, we use pascals and cubic meters. And of course, the A and B constants are going to be adjusted for those new units. Let's see what we get in this case. So what we did was plug the numbers and crank. That's the algebra part. So once you get to the equation itself, you know which equation to use, your physics is done, and now algebra takes over. But it is interesting now to see the results. Notice the final result is that there's actually less pressure. And they wonder where is that coming from? Well, first of all, the adjustment due to the electrical forces did increase the pressure because even though the molecules are far apart, there's still going to be some repulsive forces causing the pressure to be increased just slightly over what it would have been without those forces. But because the molecules take up space, well, there's actually a reduction in pressure due to the, addition, the molecules taking up space, even though it's not a lot. But the reduction in pressure is greater than the addition in pressure due to the electrical forces with the net result that the pressure will be actually be less than what we see if you use the ideal gas equation. So there's an interesting uh, observation, but at least now you know how to use the equation, the van der Waals equation, both in the liters atmosphere units and in the MKS units where we use cubic meters and we use pascals. And that is how it's done.